Hello guys, today <coughs> I'm going to show you the easiest way of how to solve this kind of error. Uh, incorrect format parameter. I know this can happen due to several reasons. Uh, maybe sometimes when you try to upload your database with that, uh, I mean import your database with that uh, selecting the, the, the database or mostly it happens when the database that you are uploading have exceeded the limit that uh, example here see uh, the maximum uh, uh, upload limit is only 40 so there are a lot of ways of how to solve it but I'm going to show you the easiest one using CMD so let's get started the first thing you will need to do is create the name for the database that you want to upload let's call as youtube that is done and then the other thing what you do is come to your exam control panel come and uh, click at cell so as I said, uh, you need to copy the path, the absolute path of the of the database. Come to security where you will get the absolute path. Copy it. Let's go back to our terminal. Here, write my S square. My S square this you that is for user you put the username your own username mine is the default one root then uh, p for password and then now the name of the database that we are, we have created that we want to upload to this this one here this one so the other thing is uh, we do this and then we pass the path of the of the database so press enter if there's if your database has password then you need to put it if you done if you doesn't have it what you do is again you press enter so you will have to wait until it completes uploading so I'm going to pause it for a moment until it completes uploading. Yes, now as you can see, our database upload is uh, complete. Uh, we come and check. As you can see now, when we refresh, all our files are already here. See how easy it is. All our database is uploaded successfully. You do without doing anything. You don't need to configure any other file from the ZAM installation folders. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. Thank you.